I can tell you this, a hundred years ago, uh, or 150 years ago, Seminole Indians would not have been talking about uh, whether or not this black person has Indian blood. It simply wouldn't have mattered. They were Seminoles. You know what the motion is? Then go ahead and vote on it. So. For more than a hundred of those years, black Seminoles held four of the 28 seats on the tribal council. But that ended at a meeting like this one in the summer of 2000, when the red Seminoles voted the blacks out. Sylvia Davis, who was one of the four black council members at the time, says it was humiliating. It's been hard for me to sit there and um, listen to the way they talk to the freedmen. It's been very hard for me. What do they say? The racist names that they be using to them, calling them animals' names, cows, stomping feet, roaring at them, telling them to get out. They don't want you. That's right. They'll tell you to go back to Africa. Why do you think the freedmen, the black Seminoles, belong as part of this tribe? Because we have people that die along the trail, just like any other people in the, in the nation. But I guess they're saying, yes, thank you. You fought alongside us in Florida. That was 200 years ago. It's time for us to separate. I would just let them know that we have all rights within the Seminole Nation. But Chief Haney says many of the black Seminoles and even some of the blood Seminoles weren't interested in being part of the tribe until it included benefits, namely a piece of that $56 million government payout. The tribe wanted to have uh, an Indian tribe that was all Indian tribe. There are too many freedmen. I think there's a lot of freedmen out there now that are eligible to join, but have not joined because there are no benefits. But you think if there were benefits for them, suddenly freedmen would be coming from yes. all across the country? Yes. Let me tell you what it looks like from the outside, though. It looks like the freedmen fought wars, died with you, moved on the trail of tears from Florida to Oklahoma with you. And now suddenly there's a big pot of money Let's exclude them. That, that may be true to some extent, but I don't think that's all of the uh, reasons 